As long as white supremacy is alive and well, a white man's heaven is a black man's hell. Many look, but few see, that the most unjust dynamic in the world is white supremacy. Hi, right, welcome back to Color Me Poetry. I'm Danny Queen. I'm here with Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And we're discussing his book, uh, Textbook for Victims of White Supremacy. Mr. Fuller, you have a long title here. Tell us about the title. The United Independent Compensatory Code System concept. Mm -hmm. United means that, in theory, or in intent, the people who are the victims of racism mm -hmm. and are the white people who are against the proliferation or the, the continued use of racism as a standard for the world's business should be united against that standard. The independent part means that each individual mm -hmm. has to do what he or she can to counter racism with the ultimate objective of ending it and replacing it with a thing that we loosely call justice, ultimately leading to peace, quote unquote. Now that means that you're independent, you are a independent so person. So it's not a collective effort. It's collective in that you go to the third words, third and fourth words, compensatory, code. You become collective by using a code, mm -hmm. the code of compensation, making up. That's what compensatory means, for making what up for missing. what's missing. Mm -hmm. Right, and you have a code to make up for what is missing. What is missing is the use of truth to produce justice and correctness, which theoretically would equal peace. So you come up with a compensatory code, a way of thinking, speaking, and acting each and every day in all of the nine areas of activity. Then you use that code as an individual, wherever you happen to be in all of those areas of activity. And right now, uh, you don't have, it's only a concept. That's where the word concept comes in. See, it's strictly theory right now. You don't have a concept of white supremacy without the practice, because white supremacy is being practiced. A concept of the elimination of white supremacy and our racism and our injustice is strictly a concept. There's no such thing as justice existing anywhere mm -hmm. on the planet, since the definition for justice is guaranteeing that no person is mistreated. People are mistreated all over the planet all the time. So you just have a concept of justice. What you have is practical injustice. It's the difference between having a concept of justice and having it actually in practice. Now here you say the people uh, of the known universe, the, it says the people, just reading off the back, the people who have the ability to eliminate racism do not have the power to do so. And the people who have the, uh, the power don't have the will or the ability to do so. Well, that's obvious. Mm -hmm. If you are imprisoned unjustly, it means that you do not have the power to get out of prison because of two factors. You don't have the will or you don't have the ability. Now, those who are the victims of racism don't have the ability mm -hmm. because they do not have the will that provides the ability or the ability to provide the will to not be victims. Also, the racists do have the will and the ability to practice white supremacy. They have proven that. Hmm. And that's why you say that there really can't be such thing as a black racist. No. Because it has to do with the ability to... It has to do with the power relationship. It has to do with something that you're actually doing. Carrying out. Mm -hmm. You're actually doing it. White supremacy is a fact. A lot of people do not like to admit to its existence. But any comprehensive analysis would show that such a thing does exist. So therefore, you can't have a white a system of black supremacy within a system of white supremacy. It's a total contradiction. Mm -hmm. regardless, of, um, regardless of all that has been said or done, the quality of the relationship between black and white people is, and black, black and white people has been a total disaster. Yes, it's a total disaster. What you mean by total is... At this particular point, it is total because there is not a quality relationship between white people and non-white people on this planet because 
of the existence of the system of white supremacy. That cuts out any ability of anybody to produce a quality relationship between black people and white people. It also uh, eliminates the possibility under the system of non-white people, black, brown, red, and yellow, interacting with each other or even with white people in a manner that is quality. By quality, we mean justice. We mean with truth. We mean doing the correct thing. You can't do it under a system of white supremacy because the system of white supremacy is based on mistreating people and having the people react to that mistreatment. So what you have is just a lot of abuse and reactions to abuse and a continuation of the same. Now, you do accomplish a lot of technical things. Such as? Well, such as uh, production of uh, building of bridges, the building of uh, highways, the building of buildings, uh, of schools that, by the way, support the system, the system of white system. supremacy. Mm -hmm. Right. And all of these things are designed to do just that. It's a giant ego trip for a white person to be told that because you're white, you are somewhat substantially royal. And so you should act like it. So that's a lot of incentive. Now, a non-white person sitting, say, in a classroom setting mm -hmm. is told directly and indirectly within the system of white supremacy, now you are being trained to be a victim of all of this. So are you saying that, sitting in, that two students sitting in the same classroom can come out with, after 12 years of education, quote unquote, can come out with completely different uh, concepts of themselves and, and different concepts of the society in which they live. Even within though they're the sitting system in the of same white classroom. supremacy, within the system mm -hmm. of white supremacy, it is absolutely required. In other words, the white student is being taught systematically how to be a white supremacist. Mm -hmm. The non-white student is being taught how to be a victim. So you have an mm -hmm. opposite right mm -hmm. there in the same, in the classroom. same classroom at the same time. And the